Hey guys, in this video I'll be showing you the steps on how to integrate cosine of square root of x. So our first step is to use substitution where we let t equals the square root of x. So our new integral would be the integral of cosine t dx. Now we want to find something for dx, so we find dt dx. This will give us 1 on 2 square root of x. And rearranging our equation over here, we can find that dx equals to 2 times square root of x dt. So integral would be cosine of t times 2 square root of x dt. However, we want our axis to be in terms of t, so we can integrate with respect to t. So if we look over here, we actually know what the square root of x equals to is simply t. So we can replace the square root of x over here with t. And we can also take out a common factor of 2 from our integral. So we have 2 integral cosine of t times t dt. And now we use integration by parts to evaluate this integral. So we have our u equals to t. So du equals to 1 times dt and now dv which is cosine t means that our v which is the integral of cosine t equals to sine t so using our integration by parts formula for the brackets we have 2 times u times v which is t sine t minus by the integral of v du so 1 times sine t dt so if we work out the integral of this term over here the integral of sine t is negative cosine t so a double negative means we plus cosine t plus a constant and our last step is to replace all the t's with our square root of x to bring our integral back into the x world. So we have 2 square root of x sine square root of x plus cosine of square root of x plus c. And this over here is your answer. 